It feels like RX Vega has been out for nearly an eternity at this point, perhaps because it was a pretty huge lead town. Either way, tons of custom Vega cards are finally here. Plus, HDMI 2.1's official specs have been released, we can expect Raven Ridge desktop APUs pretty soon, and AMD is releasing their big update next month. So stay tuned. <laughs> Welcome back to GamerMeld. While I went over XFX's custom card not too long ago, Gigabyte, Asus, and PowerColor have all finally unveiled their lineup of custom Vega 64 and 56 cards. While each variant has something of their own to offer, there are a couple things that seem to stand out. First, the PowerColor Red Devil Vega 64 seems to have the highest clocks by far. That is, if Asus can't beat it since they didn't release the clocks yet. Either way, the Red Devil has a base clock over 150MHz higher than the reference base at 1417MHz and a boost of 1607MHz, probably due to the triple fan setup and very nice heatsink array. The second cool feature comes from Gigabyte with 6 display outputs. That's 3 HDMI output ports and 3 display ports. This gives you the option to run as many as 6 monitors with a single card. Next up for today gives us the final specs for HDMI 2.1. To put it lightly, this new 48 gigabit per second bandwidth should keep monitor makers, GPU manufacturers, and game developers busy for many years to come because it can support up to 10K at 120Hz refresh rate. You heard that right. It's still tough for some of the highest end GPUs to fully maintain 4K at 60fps. Try multiplying the resolution by 2.5 then doubling the frames on top of it. That's what HDMI 2.1 can handle. Yay for ports driving the industry forward. It's your turn, TV and monitor makers. Now get to it. The third story on the list shows us that AMD's desktop reviews are being prepped for release pretty soon with motherboard manufacturers releasing BIOS updates to support the upcoming low-cost desktop APUs. Most outlets seem to think AMD will make the announcement at CES like it has in the past. That means early 2018 should be a time to mark your calendars. Lastly for today, AMD has teased their upcoming annual Radeon software update. Unfortunately, with this quote-unquote tease, they didn't even show us some ankle. It's called the Adrenaline Edition and set to release in December. All we know so far is that it empowers gamers and enriches that visual experience. Yeah. I'm calling it, though. Software only FreeSync 2018. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. No, that, that's a hardware thing also. Please don't hashtag this. It's not happening. So while that does it for today, what did you think of the news? Want to pick up a new custom Vega card or just a little curious about this upcoming Radeon update? Let me know down in the comments below. And don't forget to share this video if you liked it, it definitely helps the channel out. That does it for now. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe by clicking on the round icon in the middle. You can check out the most recent video and suggested video to the left. Thanks so much for coming, and as always, have a great day.